entertaining universe. So there's just been a lot of stuff happening that I want to catch you up with that's going on in my life now. I, there's not a lot, of, you know, a lot of you may think that these are pointless facts about me for even though they're not, you know, full on facts, just a few things that I've been doing recently um, that you may not like or you may think I'm lazy or you may think I'm ungrateful or any of that stuff. But we'll talk a little bit more about that later on in the blog. So, I have, I had st I have downloaded and started replaying um, Jurassic World the game. And I'm a little bit, a little ways into it right now. And it's, it's kind of an addicting game because you're, you're, you're building up your park. You're, you know, tearing, you know, these p pieces of your park down so that you can have more room for, you know, your carnivores, your, your amphibians, your herbivores and your birds, basically. And that's not just, that's not the only thing that, Ha that happens in that game. You can, you know, add, you know, buildings and and there's there's the sea creatures. There's the the says says Cenozoic era, which is the snow-like animals, you know, or dinosaurs, I should say. And I haven't played it in a while. And I thought, hey, I just finished watching the Jurassic World films. Why don't I put start playing this game again? And I've been playing it since Thursday, and today is Saturday. And, you know, all this fun stuff that's happening, you know, that was one of the things. Now, I've been also, in Minecraft, I've been taking down trees so I can finish building my second house. And possibly starting to work on building a third house. And there's been some new updates where you can deep, dig deeper and you can build higher. And that's kind of what I'm doing with right now with the second house is I'm building it higher and I need more wood to to for the portion that I'm working on right now for my second house. Now the first house is almost done. I just got to put a glass ceiling on it. Um, and then I'm done with that first house. The second house, it's, it's a little bit of ways away before it's going to be done. And hopefully I can get the second house done before Christmas. Now that's pushing it, but... We'll wait and see on that whole front. Also, I've been watching, rewatching the Avengers film. So I finished rewatching yesterday. I, I watched the first one and the second one. Today we're probably going to watch um, Infinity War on whether it's on iTunes or whether it's on DVD. I will be doing that along with playing Minecraft and watching some YouTube videos because I've got a lot of YouTube videos to get caught up on because I've been kind of slipping. Um, and there, some of those individuals have started doing their vlogmas and whether they started on the second day of December or they started on the first, you know, that's all part of the thing. Now, I want to go back to what I said at the very beginning. Look, every single person should not criticize someone just because of the way they look. Um, this has been, you know in my heart for the past two or three days and no one should be called you know ugly or and don't don't misinterpret what I'm saying here because I know a lot of you are going to misinterpret this look I've been called fat I've been called ugly I've been called lazy I've been called you know ungrateful I've been called all of these names it doesn't affect me as much as it used to but no one should be called that and no one should be, you know, put down for their weight. No one should be put down for how they look or how lazy or how, you know, unadventurous or unoutgoing or, um, or, you know, or whatever it is that makes it negative. No one should be done, have anything like that said to them ever at any point in their lives. No matter how you know, how much you think you're, you're, you're all high and mighty and you're at, the, you're at the top of the food chain, you're not. If you call someone ugly, if you call someone fat, if you call someone, you know, lazy or just mean things, you're probably more likely at the bottom of the food chain, to be perfectly honest with you. Because no one deserves that. Not me, 
not anyone who watches my vlogs, not anyone who's, you know, outside of the world of social media. No one deserves to be discriminated against. No one deserves to be fat shamed. No one deserves to have any of these names be called on them. And I've seen it happen so many times over the past 32 years of my life. It's not right. It's unfair. And it's no one should be called anything derogatory ever. No matter how many times I talk about movies. No matter, no matter how many times I talk about books. No matter how many times I talk about TV shows. No matter how many times I talk about YouTube related stuff. No matter how many times I talk about, you know, anything that I talk about in vlogs, whether it's talking about sports, whether it's talking about music, whether it's talking about movies, TV, YouTube, um, video games that I play, no one should be called anything. That's not, that's not the world we should be living in. It, it, a lot of people who get called these things... And I'm not trying to be negative. I'm not trying to be a downer. I'm not trying to be any of that stuff. Some individuals have mental health issues. Some individuals have depression. Where if you say one wrong thing to them, that could tip them over the edge. And they can either commit suicide or kill someone. And I'm never going to do that, just to let you guys know. And I know I don't intend, I've never intended to do anything like that. And I don't I didn't want to and I don't want to and I never will do any of that stuff to any ind individual. I will not call anybody names. I will not bring someone down. I will not do any of that stuff. And yet of everything that I've seen and I'm not trying to be, you know, trying to, you know, spew knowledge or anything like this. Please think about what you say before you say it because at the end of the day it could really hurt someone's feelings enough for them to to die by committing suicide or suicide is a huge problem in this world and I've seen so many people that I care about not not a whole lot I should say that I've seen a few individuals in my life that have done that and it's not right no one should be called names no one should be put down for how much they weigh or how dumb they may or not dumb that's not the right word you know not as smart as other individuals or anything of that nature and that could, can include being skinny or things of that nature I always always try to be as positive to every single person I've ever met or will meet or uh, whether it's on YouTube, Instagram, social media, I will always wish someone a happy birthday on their birthday. I will always be positive towards that in, towards that individual because that's who I am. I'm a positive person and I like to uplift people, not tear them down. Anyways, I'm getting a little off topic here, but we're already four days into Vlogmas. Today is Vlogmas Day 4 and there's just so much... It just seems like this month is going by so fast. And there's just so much more to experience this month. Like, there's college football bowl, bowl, bowl games. There's, you know, there's more basketball games. There's NBA games. There's more and uh, football games, whether it's NFL, high school, or otherwise. Um, there's there's some a lot of ice hockey left. Now, um... Let's talk about this because these games are over and they're done with, and or at least most of them are. So here's the thing: look, the Warriors beat the Suns last night, 118 to 96, I believe was the final score, and they ended the Suns' 18-game winning streak. The those are the top two teams in the NBA right now is the Suns and the Warriors. And they're the greatest. Both are great teams right now. And they will continue to be great for the rest of the year, I feel like. But that's just me. Um, and let's look, at the, let's look at the other stuff that happened. Like the San Jose Sharks lost. I grant you that. 
and I've been following the Sharks all season. Uh, they lost one to nothing to the New York Rangers. Um, the Folsom High Bulldogs, my alma mater, they won twenty eight to twenty seven over De La Salle last night, and they're going on to play um, a Southern California team next week. We don't know who they are yet. I mean, we do. I just don't. It's either Orange with Theory with Lutheran or uh, Catholic Cathedral. And that game is next week on Friday the 10th. I believe it's the day that they're playing. Um, I don't know. It's in Southern California. So Matt uh, Mission Vejo. Um, I don't know any more details of it. I don't know who they're playing. But they're going to be playing a Southern California team. And one of them, they both have God on their side. So the last I checked when, when I filmed this at midnight, it was, you know, it was still being played, or it was almost over, basically. And it was 64 to 54, the last I checked it. Now, I may give you, an, I may go in the description and tell you what the final score was at the end of, or later, but um, as soon as I figure out the score, and I'll tell you all that stuff. So, uh, us two birthdays, there's only one birthday today, and that is Erika Nagashima. I probably butchered that, so I'm just going to spell it out. It's N-A-G-A-S-H-I-M-A. -A -A. Go on her Twitch. Yes, I have Twitch. I'm not going to, you know, talk too much about that. Go on her Twitch. Go on her Instagram. Go on her Twitter. And go wish her happy birthday today. Because it is her birthday today. And there is um, one birthday tomorrow. And then two on, three on the 6th. And then after that, I don't really know... I mean, I do know, but we'll talk more about birthdays uh, in tomorrow's vlog. So, I will see you tomorrow with the brand spanking new vlog, and ciao. Bye-bye.